Good morning, happy Tuesday. We are in the shop. It is opening time. So I just have a few things to do to get open here. And then we're going to get on with our day. The first thing I want to do is edit a video to post. Edit two videos maybe if I have the time. It just depends on how busy we are. Uh, and then I have a couple things to get ready to ship. And then I'm not really sure what else I'm going to do today. But we'll get started with those things. Check out that cutie picture. Uh. Check out that cutie. <laughs> I was laying with the cat for a second, but he got up because he was hungry. Goofy cat. He spent all the time right there by the window with the sunshine coming through. And uh, just soaking up all the warm. Okay, what are we doing tonight? I don't know. Hmm, what should we do tonight? Probably cleaning or something. Probably cleaning or something. I'm gonna haul the laundry down to the laundry room and I could vacuum and stuff, but uh, one thing about it is it's gonna be easy enough to do. I'm just hungry. I didn't end up filming a whole lot today because it was just kind of a weird, I don't know, it was just kind of a weird day. It sounded like it was for you also. It was just worth quiet. <clears throat> yeah, I, um, it took me forever to edit the video from the weekend and, like, get it posted and stuff. And then, um, I was watching a couple YouTube videos and just, like, trying to figure out. And then I also was watching a bunch of reels trying to figure out some ideas for us to do for the store. And so that kind of took up my day. We weren't very busy with customers, but I did get an online order. So that was good. We've got some cleaning and stuff to do tonight. And yeah. probably have to make some shirts. Oh, and I was working, yeah. And I was working on some laundry today. Mm -hmm. So now we just ordered dinner from a local Italian restaurant. So we're going to eat that and probably watch Family Matters. Probably while we eat. That's yeah. how we eat. That's how we do. I'm also still reading my book. Hey guys, update time. We are. Hey you guys. <laughs> hey you guys. Hey guys. It's update time. I gotta let you know that uh, if you are in the business that we are in. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Why are you talking like that? You'll find that you've got to work at all hours of the night. Oh yeah, these late nights just up till the you know? cows come in or whatever. Nine o'clock. <laughs> Kelly got me working. Oh, Did you find us? Does he look like he's putting on some weight to you? I swear all he does is eat. Leave him alone. What are you doing that? But he has been trying to get me to give up and lay down pretty much all evening. He followed me into the bathroom. He wanted me to hold him in the bathroom. He wanted me to hold him in the hallway. He wanted me to hold him in the book room. He wants to be held. He wants to go to sleep. And But I, I don't know what he can do. You not He looks sleepy. He probably is. And lately, we've been going to bed kind of early, which I think he's really starting to enjoy. Oh, snuggy bugger. But the thing is, Hi, it's everybody. like, I can't just give up and go to bed all Every the time. Every night, yeah. <laughs> I can't just give up and be like, well, let's take 30. Oh, it's 9 o'clock. Let's go to bed. Yeah, I feel like it. Like if you start doing earlier, then it just gets earlier and earlier that he wants you to go to bed. Right. Soon it'll be like 9 a.m. 
<laughs> and he's normally okay on his own, but he's just been... He know. always has wanted us around, though. <sighs> the problem is, if I did go lay down with him at, you know, 8.30, 9 o'clock, I would fall asleep. <laughs> I wouldn't think twice about it. Making sure tonight I was up in our room actually doing some cleaning. Um, bringing some laundry down. So we don't have too many shirts to make. I think it's like five. Six. Oh, six. Here they are. I got an order for uh, some shirts. Easter shirts for the emergency department at a hospital. And so that's what we have to make now. That won't take any hardly any time at all. And then we'll go back to like our... We'll get back to our work of cleaning and... For you? Yes. Well, gee, Yogi. Do you have any cat shirts in there? Cat size? No. I'm telling you, he's putting on a little weight, maybe. Oh, stop. He is not. You know I can't press shirts with you hanging on my shoulder. He's just a baby. <laughs> He's so comfy. He's like, I love this. Oh, I have to show you a picture I took of him earlier. <laughs> you have to see it. Me? Yeah. And, and maybe you want to share. I look up the stairs. Aww, and do I, do I see? Tootie. And look. How's okay. your nose glowing? That's his ear. Yeah, I know. With the flu. There's something on the screen. Like my oh. <laughs> There's a little ear. You can see a little ear. I don't know if you can. I can it. try to put it in maybe. Oh, there it is. I was walking into the hallway and I look Be up careful, at the top buddy, of the stairs and I see Catman up there. Mm -mm, little Catman. Do your pets ever react to a full moon? Oh, like he does. He gets crazy. Oh, man. The full moon was technically last night, but for like the whole week, you get him each. Loopy, just wicky and the wacky woo. Look at these cute, show them these cute, um, screens that I have, but I just don't, I never put them on anything because I don't know what people want anymore. Dog mom. I have a bunch of them. Yeah, Kelly had bought a whole bunch of random ones. They're just, um, she keeps an envelope over here and we haven't really used anything for anything yet. This is for on um, that sweatshirt. Oh, isn't that cute? Yeah. Maybe I'll convince someone to press this for me. And I need to press this one for one of our subscribers. Since the shirt came in today, so she can, um, she needed a different size than what I had on the website, so she sent me an email. Unfortunately, I had one of these left. Awesome. So I can get her the size she needed. That's pretty cool. Yeah. It's for Tina. Hi, Tina. Remember Tina? She ordered from us once. Already. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what All right, we are up to temp. And it is time to make the magic happen here, people. You don't even need to. He'll run into the shop. You know what he does in there? He goes in there. Looks in the mirror. Looks in the mirror and rubs his face on himself. And then he'll go stand by the front door and act like he wants to go out. But he doesn't. Ta-da. Let me see it. Ta-da. Okay. Looks pretty great, don't it? As long as it didn't. Yep. Very good. We are talking about dropping a major sale, guys. Tomorrow? Yep. Well, actually, I have it set on the website to start at midnight. Oh. So, on the website and in the store, we're going to be doing, uh, for Easter t-shirts, buy one, get one, 50% off. For any of you guys Judge Judy fans? Well, ain't nobody a Judge Judy fan like you. <laughs> I do love my Judge Judy. I have always found <clears throat> courtroom type stuff to be my favorite. Like 
my favorite author is John Grisham, a lot of courtroom drama type stuff. And Judge Judy, I mean, I'm watching Judy Jump Stick now. Judge Judy, though, was probably my favorite when we were little. And uh, you know, they can, it's the same thing, but I don't know, it's even better. I don't know. I, think it, I want one of these, but I want it to say <laughs> Insurance Department or something on it. Insurance agent? Insurance agent with bunny ears. I could wear it. Well, I'm, I'm off on Friday. Yeah. I ain't wearing that on Friday. I'm off on Friday. <laughs> all right. All right, all right, all right. Check it out. There it is. To our friend Tina. It'll be completed the t shirt. Uh -huh. And the lighting makes me look like I don't have any eyebrows. That's funny. I do okay. have eyebrows. <laughs> I can assure you I have eyebrows. Um, I was sorting some laundry because there were some fallen Christmas items mixed in with our regular. So they need to go to their individual bins. Yep. I started doing that. I got them separated here. Then we just need to do laundry next. And I'm going to carry it load down. And then the room just needs dusted and vacuumed. But all in all pretty good start. I mean, it wasn't that bad. It really wasn't that bad. It's just, this room is so big yeah. that it's like... And it's so ugly. <laughs> <laughs> it's only yeah. ugly until we get it, you know, fixed the way we want it. So, um, I was used to the old house. I could clean the whole thing in two, three hours. Now it takes two or three I hours. I think this room is the size of our old house. <laughs> Well, at least it's the living room and the kitchen. Yeah, well, I'd say it's, like, at least our bedroom and the guest room at our old house put together. So, now it's, like, two or three hours between the living room, kitchen, and the front entryway. That's not counting the family room, that bathroom, or the upstairs, the library, the other hallway, the two guest rooms, yeah, our bedroom, and that bathroom. It takes forever. And lug in the vacuum is a pain, but that's okay. It's I mean, yeah, lugging the vacuum is a pain, but that's what you do when you when you gotta do it. Mm -hmm. so, what do you think, pal? I think I'm gonna read a little bit more. I think I'm going. I like to... this book. It's very interesting, but I do, it's just taking me a while. I'm, I think taking I'm, you a while. I keep you getting tired. Fell asleep with the earlier today which is kind of unlike me to do in the evenings well well today has been a very to, yawny tired day i try not to because then sometimes it comes back to bite me in the butt later when i'm like wide awake at two o'clock in the morning but i think i'm going to pray and then i'm going to just let myself get ready and go to bed wouldn't be a bad idea Good morning and happy Wednesday. I am getting the shop opened up this morning. Um, it is rainy, but it will be okay. We have a Girl Scout troop that's coming this afternoon to set up a cookie booth. So that will be fun. I just hope we get lots of people so that they can sell lots of cookies. We have had a few customers in this morning, which is really great. I'm getting ready to edit the vlog that needs to go up today. I'm all finished editing, so now I'm uploading the video. And I have been watching in between customers. I've been watching a new to me YouTuber, Sarah Caroli. She's a booktuber, uh, and I really, really am enjoying her videos. It is giving me lots of new books to add to my list, which... I definitely didn't need any more, but oh well. It has been a busy day. I was not anticipating it being quite this busy, but it's great. I will take it. Girl Scouts are set up outside right now in front of our shop selling cookies, so that is fun. I'm glad the rain held off so that they could set up outside. I went out and got cookies for us. We got some and mints, the caramel delights which are my favorite, and the peanut butter patties which are Justin's favorite. If you're not eating thin mints out of the freezer, you're missing out. 
we have about one hour until the store closes so i'm gonna go out and just keep working away on a few things and reading while i'm at it it's after work now How one more work day to go this week for you for okay. me i had a really good day at this store today the girl scouts did good at their booth i think they said they did so uh, that was fun something different right i like that i like the idea of it i mean that community you know yeah what we were looking to do yep yeah. uh, now we are going to tractor supply because our cat we could our spoiled cat needs his treats he's such a treat monster oh i he don't does. think i showed him my sweatshirt You'll have to show him. Model it for him. Sounds uh, And I got an online, a couple online orders that we're doing. And I got a good bit of my book read today while people were browsing. I was able to read a little bit. I think if I could actually just like dedicate a little bit of time this evening, I might really be able to finish it. It's like, I really like it. So far, it's good. How was your day? <coughs> good. Working's been, uh, like I said in the other video, the week before a holiday, it really is. So, There's not a lot going on, so it's been, so. it just makes days feel like they take longer. So I love the fact that I'm not like completely overwhelmed, but at the same time, my days go slow. Yeah. So, it, it, you just got to decide how you want to Speaking of decide, we need to decide what is for dinner. Yeah, I'm very hungry today. Me too. And you know what? I just miss the diner. I can't believe it closed. Oh yeah, our That's local our local shopping. diner closed. And we used to go there, I don't know, pretty often. Um, We're definitely more regular than we do now. Well, duh, because it's closed. <laughs> but we used to go fairly often. Because it was like the only place that had breakfast also. And too, sometimes so. I would get breakfast for dinner. And they, yeah. they did real good breakfast. Yeah, so we really miss that. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Well, yeah. I mean, you probably learned from the past that there's not a whole lot in this town to eat. So. Correct. Which makes it harder. I wouldn't even know what time to get. We'd have to research it, but you don't want to have them anyway. I don't so. want to research it. Well, there's ducks over there. Maybe turkey. How's your dinner? Good. Delicious. What you having? Chicken tender. And pierogies. Mm. Or did you eat those already? I ate those already. I coated these though in the dry rub from oh the um, dirty dust the dirty dust and i used the uh, the ghost pepper sauce a little bit of that could it with both of those it, it's better than anything you can get anywhere else i like it way better than the garlic ones mm, that's good i should have got plain all the time you had a great day at the shop mm -hmm. and then when we got back like after work and everything we ended up just running to get more cat treats uh -huh. And then we had dinner. Uh -huh. And then we cleaned up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's pretty much it. We're but I've been uh, reading a little bit. All it was trash and I put the trash out and then yeah, the kitchen's all cleaned up. The living room looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. Um Kelly and Chris will do more laundry tomorrow. I hate laundry. I do too. It's my least favorite chore. I, mean, I wish um, I wish I'm, clothes were disposable. I'm working <laughs> at switching my mindset about it though, because like I've got to stop just saying I hate doing laundry. I just need to be grateful that. That we have laundry to do. We have laundry to do. And a place to do it. Yeah, because, like, imagine how much worse it would be if you had to, like, go do your laundry. If somewhere. I had to haul all of that to the laundromat. That would not be fun. I don't think I could do it. Or wash it by hand. <laughs> ah, the good old days. No, I'm just saying, like, it could be worse. It, yeah, it could definitely And I, we need to switch our mindset about it and just be grateful that we yep. 
have clothes to wear and you know how detergent laundry to wash. Everybody's the same way though. It's like it goes to the washer and the dryer easy. It's the folding and getting it put away part. That's the, yeah. part of that for me is mainly just the fact that not everything has a home yet. Yeah. So that's why we really need to focus on organizing yeah. like our, our closet and okay. making that. But in the meantime, we're getting there. Um, so you said yesterday and today's videos are going to go together. Uh -huh. Get us caught up. Um, well, it's not like I'm behind. Well, right. Yeah, that's true. It's just there wasn't a whole lot yesterday and there wasn't a whole lot today. So I figured we could just put them together. <laughs> so um, in our, you know, Holy Week timeline here, uh, Wednesday would have been the day that Judas, one of the disciples, went to the chief priest, right? Mm -hmm. And basically sold Jesus out. Like, he told them where he was and whatever, and they paid Judas. For a um, whopping 30, 30 pieces, pieces of silver. So, we will talk a little bit more about that tomorrow, but... For One thing today, we don't want to forget is that. that Judas sold him out, and how often do we? Oh yeah, sell for him out? sure. You know, Judas I think we as one... Christians are really quick to judge Judas and be like, "Oh, Judas, what a," you know, how could he do that? But like, we do that kind of stuff every day. Yep, we sell our. Oh, and if you wanted to look up. Short. The scripture on that, it's Matthew chapter 26. So that's also the New Testament. If you're pounding around. <laughs> looking for it. And tomorrow is Monday Thursday. That's the big one. Yeah, well, that's what well, I said. We'll talk about it tomorrow. One of the big ones. So. Well, that's going to do it for today. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed. If you did. Be sure to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. And share it. And we will see you tomorrow. Good night. Good night.